Hello, young math enthusiasts. Are you ready for some fun with division? Dive right into our math quiz for kids channel for exciting division challenges. And if you're ready to test your skills, give us a thumbs up and subscribe right away. Twenty-four divided by three is time to think. Let's go to the solution. Divide the number twenty-four by three. Each group contains three units, so dividing twenty-four by three results in eight equal groups. Thus, the result is. 24 divided by 3 equals to 8. 27 divided by 3 is time to think. Let's go to the solution. Divide the number 27 by 3. Each group contains three units, so dividing 27 by 3 results in nine equal groups. Thus, the result is 27 divided by 3 equals to 9. 14 divided by 7 is time to think. Let's go to the solution. Divide the number 14 by 7. Each group contains 7 units, so dividing 14 by 7 results in 2 equal groups. Thus, the result is 14 divided by 7 equals to 2. 40 divided by 8 is time to think. Let's go to the solution. Let's go to the solution. Divide the number 40 by 8. Each group contains 8 units, so dividing 40 by 8 results in 5 equal groups. Thus, the result is 40 divided by 8 equals to 5. 54 divided by 9 is time to think. Let's go to the solution. Divide the number 54 by 9. Each group contains 9 units, so dividing 54 by 9 results in 6 equal groups. Thus, the result is 54 divided by 9 equals to 6. 32 divided by 4 is time to think. Let's go to the solution. Divide the number 32 by 4. Each group contains 4 units, so dividing 32 by 4 results in 8 equal groups. Thus, the result is 32 divided by 4 equals to 8. 12 divided by 4 is time to think. Let's go to the solution. Divide the number 12 by 4. Each group contains 4 units, so dividing 12 by 4 results in 3 equal groups. Thus, the result is 12 divided by 4 equals to 3. 28 divided by 4 is time to think.
Let's go to the solution. Divide the number 28 by 4. Each group contains 4 units, so dividing 28 by 4 results in 7 equal groups. Thus, the result is 28 divided by 4 equals to 7. Fifty-four divided by six is time to think. Let's go to the solution. Divide the number fifty-four by six. Each group contains six units, so dividing fifty-four by six results in nine equal groups. Thus, the result is 54 divided by 6 equals to 9. What is 10 divided by 5? Picture this. You have 10 objects to divide into groups of 5. How many groups can you make? Let's think about it. Ready to find out? Let's break it down. Let's imagine you have 10 objects. Can you picture them lined up? Now, think about splitting them equally into smaller groups of five. What is nine divided by three? Picture this. You have nine objects to divide into groups of three. How many groups can you make? Let's think about it. Ready to find out? Let's break it down. Let's imagine you have nine objects. Can you picture them lined up? Now, think about splitting them equally into three groups. What is 72 divided by eight? Imagine this. You have 72 objects to divide into groups of eight. How many groups can you make? Let's think about it. Ready to find out? Let's break it down. Let's imagine you have 72 objects. Can you picture them lined up? Now think about splitting them equally into smaller groups. What is 90 divided by nine? Picture this. You have 90 objects to divide into groups of 9. How many groups can you make? Let's think about it. Ready to find out? Let's break it down. Let's picture you have 90 objects. How about arranging them into smaller groups where each group consists of... What is 4 divided by 2? Picture this. You have four objects that you need to divide into groups of two. How many groups can you form? Let's think about it. Ready to find out? Let's break it down. Imagine you have four objects. Can you picture dividing them into smaller groups consisting of two objects? What is 20 divided by two? Picture this. You have 20 objects to divide into groups of two. How many groups can you make? Let's think about it. Ready to find out? Let's break it down. Let's imagine you have 20 objects. Can you picture them lined up? Now, think about splitting them equally into smaller groups. What is 80 divided by eight? Picture this. You have 
80 objects to divide into groups of 8. How many groups can you make? Let's think about it. Ready to find out? Let's break it down. Let's imagine you have 80 objects. Can you picture them lined up? Now, think about splitting them equally into smaller groups of What is 40 divided by 4? Imagine this scenario. You have 40 objects to divide evenly into groups of 4. Let's figure it out together. Ready to find out? Let's break it down. Picture yourself with 40 objects. Think about arranging these objects into smaller groups where each group... 42 divided by 6 is... Time to think. Let's go to the solution. Divide the number 42 by 6. Each group contains 6 units, so dividing 42 by 6 results in 7 equal groups. Thus, the result is 42 divided by 6 equals to 7. Twenty-four divided by six is time to think. Let's go to the solution. Divide the number twenty-four by six. Each group contains six units, so dividing twenty-four by six results in four equal groups. Thus, the result is. 24 divided by 6 equals to 4. Twenty-eight divided by 7 is... Time to think. Let's go to the solution. Divide the number 28 by 7. Each group contains 7 units, so dividing 28 by 7 results in 4 equal groups. Thus, the result is 28 divided by 7 equals to 4. How many did you get right? We bet you did awesome! Remember, practice makes perfect. Don't forget to click the like button if you had fun and subscribe so you can join us for even more division quiz adventures. Let's keep the math magic alive!